In this tutorial, I'll be showing you how to create the simple gradient um, shape effect in GIMP. I made a tutorial for this in Photoshop, so I'm now uh, making a GIMP version of it. So go ahead and open up a new image. Um, and the reason I showed it in Photoshop first is because it's a much easier effect to do in Photoshop. Um, and what To apply a nice background to my image, I'm going to grab my gradient or blend tool and make sure your foreground color is on white, or you can always adjust these colors, but this is what I'm doing. Um, I'm setting my foreground color on white and then my background color on a light gray. And then uh, make sure your gradient is on FG to BG, and then make sure your shape is on radial. And then click and drag from the center out, like that. And then create a new layer by pressing this uh, new layer icon in your layers dialog, um, or by going to layer, new layer. And what you want to do is grab your Paths tool to create a new shape. And click once on your screen somewhere. And then click and drag. Then click again. And to close off this, plat this path, press um, Control and click. And if you want to edit this last part, since it's not very curved, I'm just going to press Control and I'm going to add a new point right there and I'm just going to drag this out and now if I want to make this into a selection I'm going to go over to my uh, toolbox where the options should be and I'm going to press selection from path and then I'm going to grab my blender gradient tool again except this time set the shape on linear and then change your colors to whatever you'd like I'm going to choose a light blue and then a dark blue. And then click and drag to apply the gradient. And then go to select, grow, and I'm going to grow the selection by 5 pixels. Uh, and you can always make that number larger depending on how big you want your border to be. Actually, I'm going to grow it by a bit more. Then create a new layer and move this layer under your shape layer so that it's beneath this, uh, sh this shape. Um, and then what you want to do is set your, gray, uh, your foreground color on a light gray and then set your background color on a kind of, on a slightly darker gray. And then make sure you have your gradient or blend tool and the shape is on uh, linear and then click and drag down to apply that gradient. And then you can go ahead and select none and now all we have to do is apply a drop shadow to our border so it goes to filters, light and shadow, drop shadow. And for offset X and Y put in 0, blur radius 15, and opacity you can always adjust this later I'm gonna just set that at 100 and for, for blur radius I'm gonna set that to 20 and uncheck allow resizing. So if the drop shadow, um, if you can always adjust the opacity by going down to that layer, adjusting the opacity of that layer. Um, so yeah, that's how you create um, this nice simple gradient shape in uh, GIMP. And you can always just repeat the same effect I did to text, except um, instead of making a path, you could just right click on the text layer and select alpha to selection. Um, that's how you would um, uh, select the text. 